we, we have uh, an opportunity here uh, as we, we look at uh, the Truck Driver Training School uh, to do uh, a great service to our region. Uh, we're, we're looking so forward to, what's our timeline for uh, construction? 10 months. 10 months, all right, that's that. So we'll have a ribbon cutting ceremony in 10 months. So Pensacola State College is constantly striving for excellence in education and for stewardship in our community. And this project takes care of both of those. Well, it will not only provide education and job opportunities for those seeking skill training and employment, but it will also help fill the gap in the workplace that will help our community at large. For PSC, this facility is another testament to the power of partnership. If you would have mentioned to anyone 10 years ago that a state college was going to be involved in a truck training program, they would have said you're crazy. But what you're seeing is the reality of a pivot in the state where we're recognizing that all of our 12 universities and our 28 colleges and all of our vocational are in business for one reason, and that's to get people to work. Uh, it's certainly welcoming to see this happening in District 2. District 2 is growing very rapidly right now. Uh, we're looking at a new sewerage plant. We're looking at a $20 million plus RV park. We're looking at growth in our industrial parks. It's just uh, phenomenal to see that. I've been on the board 19 years now, and to see all that growth uh, finally taking place in District 2, and you know, it, it's it's just phenomenal to happen. Uh, this is a this is a huge need. There is a national shortage for truck drivers, for class, uh, certified commercial driver's license drivers, and the Pensacola State College stepped up to create this program. Uh, thank you on behalf of um, Triumph Gulf Coast. Thank you on behalf of industry members uh, who really need this. It, it, that shortage, national shortage, uh, is hurting us here as well, and it is, it is a big demand. So we thank you for the work you're doing uh, with this project, and 10 months can't not come quick enough, so please beat that schedule. And thank you very much. Yeah, we, we're getting people on the road, and, and that's kind of what we were tasked with and charged with with starting the program, and we're doing that. Um, with this facility that you're going to see over the next 10 months. So it really has been a community project. Um, I know we don't have community in our name anymore, but I think that's what our mission is, is to serve the community and those needs, and this is a prime example of it. Thank you.